1001. I wonder what the libertarian solution is to lead when lead is everywhere. Where would one move to get away from lead poisoning? Well, the point is, I would like to know what the solution was. Like, what is the agency? What is the business bureau? What, 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 what professional organization would be set up under a libertarian regime that would do testing of lead and then say, hey, this is uh, this this product that's ubiquitous is is we, we're, we're going to dock you. What I mean, how does that even work in that? The lead industry would monitor itself and then they would get punished because somehow we would all collectively punish them somehow. Right. And that it would some, all nicely work out somehow in some somehow some, way. Some, uh, somebody would get commissioned. Some lawyer would take a, would, would commission a study for 30 years <laughs> to measure the lead effects. Right? And then they would go out and sue these companies. And then they would get... and then. What would prevent the 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 lead uh, additive industry from saying like you know what all right here's thirty billion, bye. I mean tobacco is not even outlawed at this point, right? They just had a settlement, so we would still have lead in the atmosphere, but we yeah, everybody would get a settlement. You know we would we would fund more prisons. I mean how would that work? That's, that's the real implications about this. And I loved, and I can't wait for libertarians to talk about the unintended consequences of government policy to highlight this one, because this one is massive. Do you understand how big this is? The lost productivity, the human suffering, the expense for society, the uh, ability to uh, give a rebirth. I mean, does anybody in this, anybody anywhere think that New York would be producing what it's producing, would be this uh, city for only wealthy people if it wasn't for this lead abatement, if this, if this causation is correct? And then the implications of having more people being able to function in cities as opposed to living out in the suburbs, which would have perpetuated, I mean, it's just, it's almost immeasurable to measure the benefits of this one EPA law. 